Next is paragraph type question for question number 59 and 60. It says that to promote its brand, a cold drink company gives a scratch coupon on purchase of each bottle of cold drink which has any one letter written on it out of the letters of the word Limca. If a person shows five coupons having all letters of word, he gets a free bottle of cold drink. So, in question number 59, it says that the probability that a person gets a free bottle on purchase of five bottles of the cold drink is P by Q, where P by Q are co prime, then we have to answer the following options. Right. Let us assume here that we have X1 coupons of L, we have X2 coupons of I, we have X3 coupons of M, we have X4 coupons of C, we have X5 coupons of A. I hope this is clear. We have taken X1 number of coupons of L which the person have got. Right? So, according to the question, sum of all this should be equal to 5 as he have purchased 5 bottles. So, sum of all these should be equal to 5 where each one of them are greater than or equal to 0. Right? So, we are finding the number of elements in the sample space first. So, this is greater than or equal to 0. So, number of solutions of this integral solution is n plus r minus 1 c r minus 1. That is 9 c 4 that is equal to 9 factorial divided by 4 into 5 factorial. That is 6 7 8 9 divided by 4 3 2. Now, 3 into 2, 4 2. That is 14 into 9 that is equal to 126 right now we have to find the probability that a person gets a free bottle on purchase of five bottles so he will get a free bottle if he gets one coupon each of all the five so there is one way so number of elements for a required event e is one so probability of e is equal to one upon 126 now 126 is a prime number? No. Number of divisors of 126? 126 is equal to 6 into 21. That is equal to 3 into 2 into 3 into 7. That is equal to 2 into 3 square into 7 raised to the power 1. So, number of divisors is 2 into 3 into 2. That is equal to 12. So, this is correct. Number of divisors of Q is 2. That is incorrect. P plus Q is a prime number, 127 is definitely a prime number, so answer is B and D. Now next is question number 60, which says that if a person already has two coupons written A on them, he have two coupons of A and A, then the probability that he gets exactly one free bottle of cold drink on purchase of eight more bottles, right? So firstly, let's find number of elements in sample space. He have 8 bottles now. So, x1 plus x2 plus x3 plus x4 plus x5 is equal to 8 where each is greater than or equal to 0. So, 8 plus 5 minus 1 c4 is equal to 12 c4 that is equal to 12 factorial upon 8 factorial into 4 factorial that is 9, 10, 11, 12 divided by 4, 3, 2, So, this is 45 into 11, that is equal to 495. So, these are the number of elements in sample space. Now, let's talk about our favorable cases. He gets exactly one free bottle of cold drink. So, he already have two coupons of A. So, we can say that X1 plus X2 plus X3 plus X4 plus X5 is equal to 8 with the condition that X2 is greater than or equal to 1 x3 is greater than or equal to 1, x4 is greater than or equal to 1 and x5 is greater than or equal to 1. So, minimum if we get one coupon each of x2, x3, x4, x5, he already have a coupon of A. So, this will give us one free bottle. But here we have to take care that if we get x1 equal to 0 and we get each of x2, x3, x4, x5 equal to 2, then he will get two free bottles. So, that is the case we do not require. So, total number of cases will be equal to, let us here 
we know that x1 is greater than or equal to 0. So adding 1 on both sides, we get x1 dash plus x2 plus x3 and so on up to x5 is equal to 9, where each one of them is greater than or equal to 1. So number of solutions will be n minus 1, c r minus 1, minus 1 case, when he will get 2 bottles free. So this is equal to 8 c4 minus 1, which will be equal to 69. So required probability of the event E is equal to 69 divided by 495. That is equal to 23 upon 165. So from the given options, option number D is the correct choice. So this was all about AITS 4A paper 2. I hope you have understood all your queries. Thanks for watching.